66-year-old Alfred Sario of Alpha sat silently Thursday morning during his murder sentence hearing. On August 18th, a jury found him guilty of second-degree murder and discharging a firearm in or at a building in the death of his stepdaughter, 29-year-old Jamie Lee James, on June 29, 2016 at his residence in Alpha. Sario's attorney, Donald Powell, asked Judge Mary Berglund to sentence his client to the recommended minimum of 15 years in prison because of his age. If you kill somebody without premeditation, then you should have the opportunity to show um, that you have been rehabilitated uh, and that you can be a good member of the public. If Mr. Sario lives that long, um, then he would have a chance to be paroled. Sario was originally charged with open murder. Although she did not get the first degree conviction she asked the jury for during the trial, Iron County Prosecutor Melissa Powell did not hold back during her chance to address the court. He wasn't thinking that he was 65 at the time that he committed this offense. He was thinking about himself and the quickest, easiest way to eliminate his problem. When he shot himself, he wasn't thinking uh, of remorse. He shot himself because he didn't want to spend the rest of his life in prison. Before his sentence was handed down, Sario's attorney read a statement on behalf of him. He writes, I apologize to my wife and the court for my actions. I know nothing can bring Jamie or ease the pain my wife went through. I just ask for the mercy of the court that I may have the hope of release someday. That hope of being paroled from prison won't happen for a long time. Judge Berglund sentenced Sario to 25 to 40 years in prison on the second degree murder charge. This was not an act of self-defense, and the sooner you realize it and accept responsibility for what you did, the sooner you can begin the healing. With the conclusion of today's sentencing hearing, Iron County Prosecutor Melissa Paul has now successfully tried two murder cases this year, the other involving Kelly Cochran, who was found guilty of murdering Chris Regan earlier this year. In Crystal Falls, Jerry Taylor, ABC 10 and the CW5.